What is up, y'all? Thank you for joining. Today, we're going to be asking this question. Has all truth been revealed or is there actually new revelation being given from God? Now, if you believe Jesus, you're going to come to the conclusion that he told the truth when he said that all truth would be revealed to his apostles in the first century through the Holy Spirit. John chapter 16, verse 13, Jesus, on the night he was betrayed, was speaking with his apostles and he told them, how be it? When he, the spirit of truth, reference to the Holy Spirit, is come, he will guide you into all truth, for he shall not speak of himself, but whatsoever he shall hear, that shall he speak, and he will show you things to come. And so Jesus promised the Holy Spirit would guide the apostles, it says, into all truth. So either Jesus told the truth and the apostles were guided into all truth, or... Jesus lied and the apostles were not guided into all truth. And how much more can you get than all truth? If all truth was revealed, that means after all truth was revealed, no new revelation would be revealed once all truth was revealed. When you're studying your Bible and you're reading the New Testament, have you ever wondered why there are no writings included in the New Testament that were written beyond the first century? That's because all truth was revealed in the first century and individuals who are saying that new revelation is being given are actually contradicting not only Jesus calling him a liar, but the New Testament tells us that these things would be done away with. It says charity, meaning love never fails, but whether there be prophecies, they shall fail. Why? Because prophetic gifts were limited to the first century and you received those gifts through the laying on of the apostles hands it says they shall fail whether there be tongues meaning individuals miraculously speaking in another human language which they had never learned it says they shall cease whether there be knowledge a reference to miraculous knowledge it shall vanish away and it says for we know in part and we prophesy in part a reference to miraculous abilities, miraculous knowledge, miraculous prophesying. And look what it says. But when that which is perfect is come, then that which is in part shall be done away. The New Testament, even in the first century, talked about a time period in Christianity where these miraculous gifts would no longer be practiced. And this time period would come into effect once all truth was revealed. Jesus said it. You read the verse for yourself. Jesus told his apostles that all truth would be revealed to them and either Jesus was telling the truth or Jesus was lying. And so you're going to have to determine for yourself, do you believe Jesus? If so, then you're going to have to believe. Look what he said again. He told his apostles he will guide you into all truth and then ask yourself this question. Why does the New Testament have no writings included in it after the first century? If God is giving new revelation today then that means the apostles were not guided into all truth. But if they were guided into all truth, then that means God is not giving new revelation today, which he's not. Leave your comments below. Hopefully you learned something new. And because all truth has been revealed, this is why we are able to contend for the faith, which was once, meaning one time only, delivered unto the saints. It's not delivered over a period of thousands of years. It says one time only, once. That's what once means. And it's a reference to there's a begin and an end to it. And that beginning and ending to the New Testament revelation was in the first century. And now we wait for the second coming of Jesus Christ as we teach the community to believe in him, to repent of their sins, to confess him, to be baptized, and to walk in newness of life as we strive to obey him. May God bless you as you search his word to learn all truth, that you might practice all truth and help love your neighbor today. God bless you. Thank you for your time. It's a dangerous world, so be safe.